How's it going everybody? I hope you're having a great week so far. Um, haven't done a video in a while, so I got this in. It's, I think it has 14 cards in here. It's a lot. Um, this is going to be for the PSA submission, so uh, let's get into it. This video shouldn't be too long. I'm just showing uh, some cards that I got for the PSA submission. Uh, let's see. I don't know when I'm going to be sending these to PSA. Um, got a few some vacation stuff coming up and as soon as I get done with that then I'm going to be concentrating on sending this all out to PSA so here's a few more for the submission nothing crazy but I thought I got some good deals on all that stuff again it's from uh, New England sports cards they're my go-to I think they got a lot of mint cards there. I'll just do them one by one. Here is the first one. little on its side there, but I'll fix that later. That is Junior Seau's rookie card. I think this is the traded. Yeah, this is the traded version. Looks pretty, looks pretty good to me. Junior Seau, one of my favorites. Tragedy would happen to him towards the end of his career, but uh, definitely a huge fan of his. This card I'm a huge fan of next coming up. That's a Select Certified 96. The Junior Sale was 1990 Tops traded. This is a 96 Select Certified. Always a fan of this. This product. I all I. Back when I collected, I had two of these PSA 10s, so having it again would be pretty cool if it came a 10 or a 9. And very underrated, I think he's like 13th all time in sacks, uh, Les if I'm not mistaken. I know he's on the sack list, but uh, Leslie O'Neill, just thought 1987 tops. It's really hard to get these cards mint, and this thing looks gorgeous. So, I had to get that. <clears throat> now, if you guys see anything that I might be missing or whatever, cause I haven't really got it. This is the first time I'm looking at these, obviously. You just saw me open them. So, if you see anything that might uh, classify it as, you know, less than mint, then uh, feel free to comment below. So, I don't know if this guy's going to be a Hall of Famer or not, but uh, he's up there on the sack list, so... Mario Williams, this is the blue version. Mario. Got, <clears throat> I just thought it was a solid card. I think, what is this, Bowman? And it's uh, 147 out of 299. This is Top's Finest, I think, yeah. Top's Finest blue refractor, or, yeah, refractor. So that was pretty cool. Number one overall pick. Here's another Junior Seau, just his regular tops rookie card. Big fan. Just uh, seemed like an awesome dude. Like everybody, you know, that talked with him said he was a good person. And too bad what happened to him towards the end of his career. Uh, this guy. This is a pretty cool card. Sanders versus Browner. Head to head. Thought it was a really sweet card. This is just on the top loader. That's awesome. Browner. Browner was a pretty good player too. Joey Browner. They had some good battles. 91 score. So I thought that would have been that's a cool card to get graded. And here is another underrated player in my in my eyes. Tory Holt. <clears throat> this is his Bowman's best rookie. I just thought he was a... I think he's going to be in the Hall of Fame. Especially if they do... I don't know if you guys heard or not, but they're going to do 20 in 2020, I guess, for their anniversary or whatever of the Hall of Fame. But they're supposed to induct 20 players into the Hall of Fame. So... He should definitely be getting in there. Him and Isaac Bruce deserve a 
a now this is the this is the same card of Mario Williams. It's just a it's a super fractor or X fractor or something like that. I thought it was pretty cool. Mario Oh yeah, X Frack. So this is a 166 out of 250. Mario Williams. That was pretty cool. Always a fan of his when he was on the Bills. Um, Texans, he was solid. When he came to the Bills, he just he was he was pretty much a beast in my eyes. And you got Derek Thomas. I know it's only his pro set, but <clears throat> I thought it was a pretty solid card. Looked pretty mint to me. So. Had to get that. Derek Thomas. Huge fan of his. I'll never forget that. When they played the Seattle Seahawks. And he had seven sacks. He was just a monster. Dave Craig. Poor dude that day. Then I got Torrey Holt. Another one. Is Bowman rookie card? Most of the little dots you see are just all that stuff that usually gets on it, the lint or whatnot. Pretty sweet. Tori Holt. Hopefully he makes it soon. And here's his partner in crime, Isaac Bruce. They're a Excellent tandem together. Upper deck star rookie. Big fan of Isaac Bruce. I think he was like the, for some reason he seems to be like the first speed speed receiver that I can remember. Just a total mismatch. Here's Marshall Falk rookie. <clears throat> it's collector's choice. Nineteen ninety four. Sorry about that. All right, back again. Sorry about that. So yeah, here's a here's a Marshall Falk rookie, 1994. This is collector's choice. Up a deck, and here's another Marshall. Top Stadium Club Marshall Falk rookie card. Oh, this is 1995, actually. It's not his rookie. That's a 95. Still, cool card. For some reason, I thought this was his rookie. I don't know why. Hmm. And last but not least, Marvin Harrison. This is his 96 Pinnacle Rookies. Rookie. Wasn't a very big dude, but man, he was awesome. I guess this Pinnacle Silver. I didn't know there was a difference. That's cool. Awesome, that's it, guys. That's all, all the cards I got. Um, I should be doing another video soon, probably this weekend. So, uh, see you all then. Hope you have a great week. Take care, guys.